Good morning everybody and today I'm going to show you how I am preparing for my competitions and how I prepare to have the best performance possible and also I will teach you how you can find your own workouts, your own protocols to follow and to prepare for your best performance in your big days, in your big competitions. So without wasting any more time, let's start. So right after I wake up, I go to the bathroom and do all of the hygiene stuff. And right after that, I go and I do my quick stretch. It only takes between five to 10 minutes. So let's do it. Here I am and let's do it. So I start with, of course, stretching my neck because in windsurfing it is really quite important to be able to watch over your shoulder after I stretch my neck then I stretch my arms and my back for this stretch I really need to find wall Place your fingers on the ball and, and turn into the other side of your arm. Now uh, I stretch my back. I am quite bad at this uh, stretch. I do two versions of it. First with the straight legs and then with the bent legs. In this way I can feel way more muscles. Oh, so good. I stretch my side of my back. And then quickly my legs. I raise my toes, bend down, then lower and up. And it's so good. Trust me guys, it's amazing. You feel a lot of pain, but it really helps afterwards. And of course for the other leg. When the stretch is done, uh, then I go for it quick morning run I buy quick I mean a 15 to 20 minutes and this time is because of how long is the race so first lesson that I'm going to teach you is to find out what your sport requires does it require stamina does it require VO2 max does it require strength for me it requires all of these three things stamina, VO2 maximum, whoops, and strength. The races are mainly 15 minutes long and so I'm training myself for, for 15 minutes. Find out what you need and do exercises to improve the things that you need. Let the run begin. Running doesn't have to be easy. You have to, you have to run in that pace when it's hard, but not too much. So, remember, if you go hard, you will not go home. So, let's go. It's hard, but it has to be, so because when it's hard only then you improve so remember that and let's go now the run is done i finished it in 18 minutes and it was 2.8 kilometers so it's really good i am all sweaty and now i'm going to go to the shower and then i make myself some food here I am at home, after the run, I am all sweaty, all quite tired, but trust me, it's not over, because the big workout, the strength workout is coming up, so stay tuned, and now let's go to the shower and eat. So after showering and eating the food, I decided to go and do a quick work, uh, here you can see to edit a short video and now the time came 
to do the big workout, the strength workout. So before we do, I want to quickly make a protein shake and then we will start the protein shake we have been made. It's really, really simple, I'd say. <laughs> well, it is not, I'd say, but yeah, uh, it's just water and protein powder. And I, I and I use it, uh, and my powder is strawberry flavored. So yes, it's quite tasty and it really helps me. So without wasting any more time, let's go and do the workout. First of all, we have to warm up. Well, actually, in this weather, I don't really need to, but, but of course, it's better if I do. So, first of all, let's spin around our necks, then our arms, elbows, then wrists, and then belly. So, the warm up is, is finished. And now it's time to start exercising. This workout should take between 30 and 40 minutes. It's relatively fast and it is really hard and really effective for, for this length of uh, exercising. So I would really recommend you to do this, this and let's start. I have started the timer and let's go. Uh, so first of all, I will do push-ups, but not regular ones but this so put your uh, fingers outside of your body to look it in this in this way and uh, your shoulders have to be above your arms and go in this and do 10 of these three reps uh, three uh, three sets So after the push-ups are done, I'm going to do something for my legs, which, which is squat jumps. So squat and jump, squat and jump, and also do 10 to 12 repetitions and three sets. Okay, let's go. After we do the jump squats, now we can do exercises for these parts of our arms. So you have to find a wall, then rest on it and push yourself with your wrists by straightening your whole arm and do 12 to 15 repetitions, okay? And do them. So after doing leg raises, it's now time to do archer push-ups. They are quite difficult, but the goal is to give the most work to your chest. So which means you do push-ups quite wide, really wide, and your goal is to move from one arm to another arm. And do this, but of course move not your arms, but your core body. So let's see how I'm doing it them stand wide and move from one arm to another and do 10 repetitions do two more sets i really really want you to do this this exercise because uh, it makes your back stronger uh, for more specifically these muscles because they are really often forgotten and in the gym and in the usual uh, machine workouts so do this exercise because if you don't in the end after after a few years of uh, forgetting your back it will start hurting and it will start hurting badly so trust me 
also lay down put your arms behind your uh, head uh, activate your muscles in here and in here in your legs and when they are activated go up and down up and down and do not release them and of course do three sets this is how i'm preparing for my big days big events big championships so i'm encouraging you to also find your ways to improve aspects of your sport which you just cannot improve without doing something more than your regular training sessions for me i cannot improve my core body strength while i'm windsurfing for you maybe you're a footballer you can always, always, every single day improve how good you're running, how fast you're running. Because you can run anywhere, anytime, any, 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 uh, yeah, you understand. So I'm encouraging you to find ways to improve in your own sports. So be better and let's improve together. Oh, by the way, uh, do you want to see my workout that I have been doing here in this video? Press the button in here and watch it till the end because it's worth it.